welcome back welcome back welcome back i know it has been a minute but we're finally getting to it and today we have a nail video so as you see we just starting off with um just fresh and clean nails now usually i use my drill when i go ahead and file my nails off but i was supposed to be putting on my long press ons like the week before but i for this um show but i didn't end up putting them on so that's why i'm just using a file only because you know it's been like a week but i still felt like i didn't want to use a drill just not to be too harsh so i'm just going ahead and using this hand file now you can use a drill or a hand file and that's why i'm glad i actually can show you guys how i do my nails with you know a hand file instead of a drill just because i know everyone does not have a drill but you just want to use the drill just to get off you know any shine off the nail any extra glue if you have any you know any extra things on the nail that's not supposed to be on the nail and also to give the press on nail a good surface for it to actually stick to now i do want to apologize because this was my first time filming like this you know i was just trying to make it do what it do so it is a tad bit blurry but you guys just bear with me like i said this is my first time using this and yeah so what i have right here is a cuticle clipper um and one of these nail kits i got it came with a different kind of cuticle cuticle clipper and it's okay but i prefer this kind because i can actually manually clip the my cuticles you know off and that other kind is just a little too dangerous for me but you just want to go ahead and clip your cuticles as such um if you have a drill you can use the drill but like i said with this video i'm kind of doing a lot without the drill i do bring it out eventually and i will explain why i end up bringing it out but for now you know we just doing a lot of manual manual labor So these are the nails I'm using. I literally just got them from my hair store. I seen them like previously, they're by kits. And I was like, oh, these is given. So I was like, the next time I go in this hair store, I'm gonna go ahead and get me some of these press on nails. So I went and got these. What comes with the nails is this pink kiss glue, um, the nails, a little small orange wood stick, AKA a little cuckoo pusher and a really tiny, um, nail file i like kiss glue i have bought this other glue before but kiss glue is cool um this is like my second time using this pink kiss gel nail glue and you know it still lasts pretty good but i've noticed in order for press ons to really last please follow these steps because before they wasn't lasting because i wasn't doing the necessary filing and things i needed to do but this is just me showing you guys the design of the nails it's very very cute very very clean giving very very classy it's not super short it's also not super long because if you know me you know i love me my long nails um now all of the nails don't have you know the gems and all designs and you will see literally only one hand has the gems on it just because you know the corresponding gems doesn't match up with the numbers like you know um a number seven might have a gem but another number seven might not but it still matches with both hands and you know i have gems if i wanted to add gems i can add gems but what i'm doing right here is just sizing up my nails seeing which ones fit and you know usually nails have numbers underneath so if they have numbers just save yourself the trouble and just look at the number that's what i eventually started doing to make this process go by faster but yeah just size your nail up you don't want it to be too small you also don't want it to be too big if you do have to file the sides go ahead and do so but you know these fit pretty good up towards my cuticle area which i love and you're going to see how towards, once you see the end result of these nails, they look so natural. They look like I got it done in the line, honey. And I'm just doing this, I literally want my bed. Like, stop playing with the person ones. Like, I really want a love for them. So 
so as you see right here i'm taking a little file and i had to bend it in order to you know file down the inside of the nail you want to do that on the part that's going to be actually on your nail because this is, is the key that also helps the nail to stick on longer you need to file your natural nail bit and also the false nail you need to file that as well so it's not like super smooth and shiny you need to remove the shine on the false nail as well and give it you know that rough surface which helps the glue adhere better to your nail now i brought my drill out because that file was just you know flimsy and you know it was just you know cheap so i had to bring the drill out because it just wasn't getting inside the nail like i needed it to so i just bought this drill out i had it for a while now but i had got it off amazon it probably was less than 20 dollars. i believe the brand was air c as you've seen and i just used a small little tip a drill inside the nail and then we're going to get to the gluing process <music> forget the alcohol you want to use alcohol to clean off the extra um dust from the filing i don't clean it off of the nail tips you can but you know the nail tips don't leave too much dust it really be a natural nail bed that leaves the dust so i'll just use some alcohol and a cotton pad just to clean off that extra dust off my natural nail bed <music> so now with the glue this is key um in this video you'll see or you might not because like i said it's a little blurry but you don't want to use too much glue but i apply glue to the nail bed and to the nail that is also a key in order to get your press on to last you more than a week more than a couple days usually these could last me about two almost three weeks but i do work with kids and stuff so sometimes they'll be coming out faster than they usually would but as you see i'm putting some glue on my nail bed and also on the nail tip what i started doing was uh, eventually i was applying the glue more towards like the free edge of my natural nail bed and then on the nail tip applying it mainly just to like the cuticle area and then i just place the nail on i press it really firm now if you apply too much glue the, the glue is of course going to seep out but you also want to apply enough but not too much but in this video i actually was applying a lot but you know you want to apply a good amount you know because you want these things to last you want them to be strong thick and fresh but just you know make sure you are applying it to your nail bed and the nail tip because that is key
also do not apply the nail on to like your cuticle like i apply it a little bit up i just get it very very close but i don't put it on the skin because that will cause a lifting so you just want to get it close enough and also not too far especially with these you can kind of get away with it because you know it's not color nails the it's very very natural so it looks like you know acrylic and that's what we want to give sis we want to give acrylic nails so natural you're going to see a better clip of it you know not super blurry but even in this clip y'all it's super super natural super super cute it's really giving what to the nail salon well we really just got some press ons and denim at home like at the comfort of our home so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i definitely want to do more um don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know if there's different brands you want to try different glues um and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video. So don't dare, push me when I go, cause I know what to